When it comes to electric vehicles, range anxiety is a real problem and it's not something that just common people like you and I who buy normal cars and bikes struggle with. Even commercial players who have electric buses, trucks, three-wheelers, they also struggle with this problem. But Omega Seiki Mobility has a solution to that to a certain extent with their new and latest offering. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the OSM Victor. It's a new electric three-wheeler which is yet to launch. Actually, it'll launch just now and will be available by the time you see this video because TOI Auto has got exclusive information and has exclusive access to these vehicles. And this vehicle has a range of 250 kilometers. This is the real world range, which means the company has gone and tested and this vehicle has done 250 kilometers in just one charge, making it the first and only electric three-wheeler to achieve this feat. Now, what the price of this vehicle is, how they have achieved this range, what the specs are, we will tell you in this video, so stay tuned. They say that the proof is in the pudding and this right here is the pudding. This is the very unit that did the 250 kilometer ride from Murthal to Solon on a single charge. And that is quite a feat for an electric three-wheeler in India right now. Now this has been possible because of its larger battery pack. OSM has other electric three-wheelers which have battery packs ranging from about 7 kilowatt hours to 10 kilowatt hours but this one has a massive 20 kilowatt hour battery compared to them which means that it can deliver that very range. Now as for charging times, well the charging time for this vehicle if you go from 0 to 100 is about 6 hours and if you go from 0 to 80 that is about 5 hours. But just making a bigger battery and putting it onto the vehicle is not the solution to increase its range because that's only going to make your vehicle heavier, hence having a toll on your range. So what did OSM do to counter that? Well, they went and checked all the parts to reduce the overall friction in the vehicle. Achieving that meant changing some internal components, changing the tires and even the type of grease that is being used to make it even more efficient than their previous products. As for the performance figures, this comes with a 12.8 horsepower motor and it produces more than 400 Newton meters of torque, resulting in a top speed of 47 kilometers per hour. So for usage, this is quite a practical product and especially if you combine the excellent range that it has, this really has potential to lead the market and it's all made in India. Now, while the blue unit has done a lot of working, it has been weathered, we thought we might call in a fresh orange unit to talk about a little bit of its design aspect and how it looks and what it gets. The design, as you can see, is pretty much like any other three-wheeler. There's nothing too fancy here, but that's not essentially a problem. It looks nice, it looks functional and utilitarian. You have a very large plastic mudguard right here. You get three 12-inch wheels, plus there is a spare one, which we will show you in just a minute. The headlamp cluster that you see, you have a turn indicator and also a headlamp and these are halogen units. So no LEDs, you also have rear view mirrors, a single wiper and the glass house is pretty big and should provide good visibility. Now this right here is the version with the closed top box and you saw the open one before this. So you can have it in these two configurations. The payload capacity is 450 kilograms. So that is also quite decent. There is only one thing that I did not quite like enough and that is the plastic quality and fit and finish at certain places. You can see some panel gaps and some creaky plastic here and there and some of the metal bits sticking out. But otherwise, all in all, it looks pretty decent. So let's talk about the interior of the Victor and it's very minimalistic. 
uh, but you don't need a lot here. You have a handlebar, you have some controls on it for the horn, for switching on the high beam and for the turn indicators as well. Apart from that, you do get a digital display, which is good to see because it can show you information in a nice manner, especially at night if you are uh, driving this vehicle. So that's also good. You also get a fire extinguisher. There's also a holder where you can keep a little bottle or something else also there. The seat, while this is meant for just one person, but the seat is wide enough for two people to sit comfortably. And there is also a nice soft backrest. A small window is right here so that you can look at what is behind you. Now let me draw your attention towards some of the smaller details inside the cabin, like the knob that's right here. You can use it to put the electric three-wheeler into either reverse, neutral or make it go forward. There is also a USB charging port right here. Plus you have on the other side a small storage space which can be locked so that is good and an LED light in there. So these will definitely make your life inside the vehicle slightly better and once again the plastic on the dash is a little flimsy but uh, the rest of the build quality is pretty good. Now let's get to the all important information about pricing because I know a lot of you would want to know the price. Well, the OSM Victor will cost about 5 lakh rupees with the subsidies and on top of that, the battery and the motor have a warranty of 3 years. So that should give owners peace of mind. Availability wise, this should be available by the time this video comes out. So you can go out and check these vehicles out or order them for yourself as well. Now, altogether, I feel that this is good that manufacturers are trying to make their products even more and more efficient, especially in terms of EVs. Now, I would just love to see more charging stations littered around the city so that the EV adoption is even faster. Well, that's all from my side for today. Do let us know in the comments if you liked this video and the information that was provided. Leave a like if you like this video. Subscribe to our channel if you have not done yet. I will see you again in the next video. Bye-bye.